U-2 pilot Francis Gary Powers makes his first public appearance since he was exchanged for Soviet spy Rudolf Abel. Powers testifies before the Senate Armed Services Committee using a model of his plane. His capture and trial in the Soviet Union caused an international furor in 1960. Now he is vindicated by the Central Intelligence Agency and praised by the senators. Still a mystery is the external explosion which sent his super-secret reconnaissance plane down deep inside Russia. Mr. Powers, would you please explain to our audience what you told the uh, senators inside about the explosion? Would you please repeat th that moment? Well, I don't have much time. All I know is that there seemed to be an explosion. I don't know what caused it, but I feel that it uh, was not in the aircraft itself. So you don't believe that it was a rocket? I can't say that. I, I just know that, uh, think that it was external. I mean, and how it got there, I have no Mr. Idea. Powers, you said the Russians told you repeatedly that you were hit by the first shot the, of the rocket. The, not the first, the very first. By the very first shot yeah. of a rocket. Yes. And you said they said it so often that you inclined to believe that they didn't believe it. Now, could you explain that? No, I said that they said it so often that uh, I was inclined not to believe it. Uh, if they had used a rocket, it seemed to me that uh, the act would have spoken for itself, and they shouldn't have to keep telling me that it was the very first shot of something. Or and you I feel really it might have been a near miss. Is that your own feeling? Well, I'm sure that there was no uh, uh, direct hit. There was no impact of any kind. You think it might have been a sidewinder type uh, of air-to-air missile? I really can't say. I don't know.